Hey, what's going on? It's Matty P here, or as Mako calls me, Matthew. I'm just getting ready for my trip to Jamaica tomorrow, and I've had some questions about what gear that I'm using to shoot this. Now, it's gonna be a little complicated this time because I'm doing this as a one-man operation, whereas before I've had uh, one to two camera guys. Shout out to Mike and Matt and Eric, who helped me in the past. Uh, this time it's a solo trip, so I've got all my gear lined up, and here's the quick tour. So first things first, uh, this is what I use for all my beauty shots. It is a Lumix GH3. I've been meaning to get a Lumix GH4 for a while, but this camera is just so damn good, I haven't felt the need yet. It's got everything I want, so I'll do most of my beauty shots on this. i got a variety of lenses. It's got an internal intervalometer so I can shoot uh, all the time-lapse stuff that I want. got a 14 by 140 lens on there, which is nice and crisp. I've got a shotgun mic, which is, oh, what's this thing stuck? Ew, um, with my dead cat on it, so it, uh, it's gonna get good audio. If you're using an SLR or mirrorless, obviously you always want better audio. I've got a Rokinon uh, fisheye, which is great. Kind of a pain in the ass to uh, focus because it's not made for this camera specifically, but it's a nice lens. Uh, this lens is totally boss, a portrait lens. It's a 1.8 uh, Olympus. 45 millimeters, so that's my portrait lens. I have a Nikon. This lens sucks. I'm not gonna take this one out of the bag. Uh, this is a nice wide 17 millimeter pancake lens, so that's get some amazing depth of field, super crisp. I love this lens. And uh, what else do I got in here? You know, the usual batteries, toys. I got some ND filters, uh, variable filters. On here, I always have a UV filter. Gotta love the UV filter, gets it nice and clean looking. So that's my beauty shot. I'll do most of the slow motion, uh, time lapse, you know, the good looking stuff I can spend some time with, but it's not good as a run and gun camera. So what I'm using for that is this Canon one, which is an XA20, I believe. I've got it on this rig here. I got it on eBay, it just, you know, helps me carry it around. Um, it's got internal stabilization, so I can get away with this one as a handheld. I've got a Rode NT1 shotgun mic for audio. Uh, this camera is very small, but it does have two XLRs, so that's how I'm doing all of my audio. Uh, this camera is actually pretty good for a small one. I was looking at renting it. It was going to cost me $800 at least, and then I found it on Kijiji. A guy was selling it for like, how much did I pay? $14.50, so I got a bag with it. Uh, it came with two... SD cards, if you can see there. Um, it came with all kinds of stuff, and I'm going to be able to sell it for, you know, at least as much as I bought it for. I, I might keep it if I like it, but anyway, a nice run and gun camera. It's super easy, super quick. I can just pull it out and start shooting right away. And I'm probably going to rig up um, this camera I'm shooting on right now, which is a Hero 4. I'm going to rig it up somewhere on the end here so I can get a nice wide shot and uh, some nice tight shots by zooming in. Um, I got a Photo Pro tripod here for stable shots, time lapse. It's not the most stable tripod in the world, but it's light and goes up small. Um, this is a sweet Manfrotto I got in China with a Gizzo head. It's really nice. As you can see, the tripod is busted, but thanks to electrical tape, it's gonna work for me for this trip. Um, Mogopod, which is just you know a normal monopod. I don't know how much I'll use that. I've got a Rode sort of extender for a microphone if I really want to. Uh, this is sweet. This is a Philip Bloom pocket dolly. So I'll put my camera on here and I can get some nice motion shots on it. Although, to be honest, I paid way too much money for that. I bought it before a gig um, where I needed the gear to look pro and uh, I think I spent way too much, like I'm embarrassed to say, like a thousand bucks. You can probably get one for 200 bucks. That's just as good. Um, you know, by the time you slow down the footage and work with it, you're good to go anyway. This is super key. Got my Leatherman here. I uh, use a screwdriver, got the knife in there. Uh, Mako likes to use this for chopping up weed, so he'll probably use that a lot. Um, look at this little bag of mystery. Duct tape, save your life. These Gorilla 
sort of extender bendy things. I'll use those to rig up cameras for super cheap and easy. I got cable ties. I've got some zip ties in here. There's all kinds of batteries, you know, lens cleaner, all that stuff you're gonna need. As far as storage goes, I got four passports. So I'm gonna back up everything. I should have plenty of room with four terabytes. Got your usual thing of batteries. Lightwise, I've got these uh, lights that my friend Adam and I used to import and sell called D's lights out of business, but it was a good ride while it lasted. So I got two of those for lighting. I've got a reflector, which I might get someone else to hold for me if I can. And uh, my awesome audio bag of mystery with uh, the first man and the first lady on it. There's President Obama and his family. Bought that from Honest Ed's in downtown. So I've got, uh, I'm on the shake there, but I've got a set of uh, lav mics, Audio-Technica. I've been using these for years. Uh, that I'll work with that on Mako when he's doing the cooking stuff. Assorted cables. I do have a uh, backup audio system of this sweet Zoom H4n uh, in case this guy goes down because I haven't actually used this guy in action yet. So I'm putting some trust in it, but obviously you want to have a backup. And uh, got my laptop there for logging and transferring, which is going to be a pain in the ass to do because I'm solo, but anyway, I'll make that work. And then last but not least, I have a Hero 3 and a Hero 4, which I'm holding right now. And I have some Rain X which obviously you want if you're shooting anything in the water. So that's basically my go-to. I've got my running gun, my beauty shots, my extra angles, and all my stuff to log and transfer and so on. So hope that helped out a little bit and uh, yeah, still have to go to Jamaica tomorrow.